I'm done. I am absolutely done with NBA 2K24. This game is dead. Just put it in the trash. It's worthless at this point, bro. As y'all can see, we got a different type of video today. I'm not gonna lie. I am actually done with NBA 2K24. For real. Let's break it down. What it do? What you gang? What you gang? I hope y'all staying blessed, man. And if so, you already know what time it is. Just go ahead and leave a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel for more content from your boy. Well, today, y'all, this is a different video, man. Like, no script today i usually spend the time you know to craft what i'm gonna do write down the script and all of that for you guys so that the video can be entertaining and concise but today bro we got something different going on like i'm speaking from the heart this game is trash let's just call it the way it is nba 2k24 is trash it's not even necessarily about gameplay because the game is is not that bad on a scale of 1 to 10 i would easily give this game a 7.5 a solid 7.5 but it's everything surrounding the game the release schedule of this game and everything in between that is what i hate with this game and it absolutely set the stage for how bad this game was going to be post release today we're october 24th and 2k decided to bring out two new hot fixes two not just one i had to restart the game twice today and i know i'm not the only one because as y'all can see some other people also did the same thing y'all can see on this twitter thread that a lot of people also had to restart a game twice today i think it was in the morning it's about time we start holding this company accountable bro we spend money on this game it's not like we're asking them to do something out of the pure generosity of their heart we don't care if they're generous or not that's not our problem and today man i'm telling y'all i'm hot bro. they can touch everything in this game except shooting some of us don't care about dunking the ball personally y'all know me i'm not a slasher like that i don't like to dunk i like like to shoot bro i like to play defense and i like to shoot the ball i'm a 3 and d guy same thing irl that's how i play that's why i like guys like clay thompson that's why i like players like og Aninobi or everybody who is a 3 and d type player those are the people i resonate with except steph curry because again i'm a warriors fan i've been for a long time but that's beside the point anyway the worst part is every time 2k decides to release a quote-unquote fix it does not fix the game look at this player right here bro i'm not crazy so i'm playing in a game first shot out the game bro first shot y'all know me man i showed 62 percent from deep look at this and this is my release i know my release two shots in a row like it's not it's not even like oh maybe it's a fluke or maybe i had low stamina no as y'all can see i did not even have low stamina all adrenaline bars but this this is the first game i played right after the two hot fixes back to back hot fixes by the way which i still don't understand why we even got it's pointless i really don't understand what is going on with this game behind the scene we got the developers calling people not skilled enough because they created a skill gap in shooting this year hey listen all that is pretty but the thing is y'all called the five percent of the community that's come to test the game what about those who just want to play like myself for fun i don't care about sweating for no hall of fame league no pro-am leagues i don't care about that i just want to hop on the game and hoop that's all i want to do i'm a basketball fan that's what i like bro every single day there's something different about this game and of course the first thing i want to touch on is shooting man y'all let me know in the comments if i'm crazy or not but how often have y'all had to readapt to shooting since september 8th first of all the first couple days were atrocious everybody was missing their shots i know some of my friends we used to shoot 70 percent in nba 2k23 with everything that happened and we could not even shoot 40 percent for the first two three days bro he took so much work practice in order for me to get to a point where i went from 37 38 percent to 50 percent and if y'all want to know how i did that the video is right there y'all can go check it out and i know for a fact the reason why it is the most watched video on my channel is because i was genuine in the way i explain things because that's what i use in order for me to go from being basically a bad shooter to a great shooter in just a couple days shooting has been bad bro and the funny part is the five percent of the 2k community the comp players who actually tested the game and gave their input how they wanted the shooting to be how they wanted defense to, and all that to be they're the same ones who aren't able to shoot right now they are here crying for pro-am because it's impossible to shoot in there too bro it is bad in pro-am for real people be breaking there i'm good man like i tried one pro-am or two pro-am games in season one and i was done bro so this is where this brings me back to my second point 
bro. The point about 2K as a company, I feel like we're just being deceived every single year with this company, bro. They say something that just isn't. They talked about how shooting has a pure green window. F that, bro. There's, I don't, I don't even think that's real, bro. Like, there's been so many people testing this in and out. It's not real. 2K basically does this every single year. They listen to the 5% of the people who actually play the game competitively and, and they listen to the casuals on the same time at the same time i know they're in a tough spot but changing hot in the game every single day is not gonna fix it bro it makes it worse for everybody at the end of the day and i'm not done with 2k as a company bro don't even get me started on all the microtransaction and all that crap i don't even care about the microtransactions to be honest if you can afford to make a build make five make ten well there go for it bro because at the end of the day we like to play this game we gotta put some money in for content and all that stuff but here's my pet peeve when we make our builds this is my day one build bro you got an 83 three ball i should be able to shoot comfortably with this season one i have i was able to shoot around 60 percent with this build bro and it wasn't just no catch and shoot all the time i was taking some crazy shots bro like some fades and i got an 82 midi so i was fading even in the midi too but today bro in this game in particular bro it didn't feel like it like every time i try to shoot the ball it just felt like i could not make it i did not even know what to do and i know my release bro i know they keep saying that they don't patch jump shots and all that but i don't believe that crap i don't actually believe anything 2k says at this point bro like i'm not even gonna lie bro just because they messed up my ability to spread the floor i had to just become like a defender and a playmaker on offense i was setting up the point guard in this game because i could not get my shots like everything i tried to do in this game was not working shooting wise it's just it's insane bro like for real for somebody shooting 59 point something 60 percent basically to not be able to time one jumper the whole game nah bro y'all y'all got it for real hey i seen a lot of videos today of people saying that they want to quit this game for good and i don't blame them bro and this brings me to my third point the toxicity in this community bro oh my god listen if you play with randoms bro you know how headache inducing that is bro the randoms and the wreck they're among the worst in all of the multiplayer modes and you know i'm not wrong on that bro like it feels like all of the randoms they just go to the wreck in order for them to lose bro i'm not even gonna like like they don't care about winning it's all about let me get my shots and let me let me do what i want basically i don't care about winning i don't care if you're playing 5v5 i have issues in my life i don't know man maybe my girlfriend broke hey, yo, up with me so i want to make sure that everybody else feels my pain hey i don't know bro like <laughs> but that's what it feels like to me this community is extremely toxic bro i thought the card community was bad because when you play card online bro you know how that is these 12 year olds bro they, they don't hold back they have some of the dirtiest mouths you can think of <laughs> in all of multiplayer games i think rec randoms take the cake bro like they're absolutely the worst it's not even close bro anyway toxicity in this community is bad that. we got the comp scene fighting with the casual scene and then we got people in the middle like myself bro like i i don't know i don't consider myself a casual but i don't consider myself a comp at the same time i just want to play the game the right way in terms of and i don't even think i'm sim because people are gonna say oh maybe you're sim nation i'm not nope. sim nothing i'm basically just playing the game the way i feel like i should be playing it if you want to be classified as a dribble god and a comp and all that that's up to you bro like there are some guys who are legit that me i'm not that bro i'm just playing the game the right way and, and look at this another brick yeah anyway i'm just playing the game the way i like it i've been a basketball fan for more than 20 years bro so i have a, a basketball game that i pay money for and i invest in microtransactions for so i want to be able to play it the way i want it's not that hard and i hate it when people keep messing with something that i find genuine enjoyment in like i don't know if y'all understand my point that's that's where i come from bro and that's what i mean seriously like i think it's about time we start having real conversations about where this franchise is headed and to be honest like where is the player base headed bro i see a lot of people just quitting like they don't play 2k after the first two weeks and i don't blame them to be honest like it's draining playing this game every single day every single hour like i don't know how the come guys do it bro like <laughs> salute to y'all bro me i would never be able to do this bro and <laughs> and i think i already played this game enough because 
believe it or not i got about 200 hours already in this game and the reason why i do that is because i have to be making content for y'all so i can't be out here making content and saying stuff that i don't know myself so that's why i put in the work i want to put in hours so that if i were to tell y'all use this jump shot or use this move is because i know it works i don't know bro like i needed to get this off my chest bro like let it go let it go let it go it's been boiling in like for the past week or so bro it's been bad like i need to figure out what is going on really with this game all and what it is that we need to do in order to get this game to where it was in the 2k the 2k 11 2k 12 2k 13 2k 14 15 16 17 19 20 and after that this game just died so what do we need to do to get it back there seriously y'all let me know in the comments man like for real i appreciate everybody commenting i appreciate everybody subscribing to the channel i hope y'all gonna be able to let me know in the comments what y'all feel about this am i just thinking too much or is it actually happening to y'all as well like do y'all feel like it's getting draining playing this game every day anyway if you made it all the way till now bro comment 2k is dead so that i know you a real one and i'm still waiting for it's ball forever to claim his hall of fame pass my boy hit me up bro like hit me up on, on x on instagram just so i can give you your gift bro like you won your prize uh if you don't need it then i'm gonna pass it to somebody else if y'all made it this far appreciate the support leave a like on this video and subscribe to the channel because i have a lot more content coming for y'all bro especially during the holiday seasons and until next time y'all stay gucci as always uchi out peace